Hey YouTube, Panda Bree here. So, Obama is trying to uh, change the American flag due to the Confederate flag because of racism and all that. And he says he wants to put it in rainbow colors. Well, President Obama, why would you want to change our American flag? Red, white, and blue means independence for all equally 50 star yeah 50 stars means 50 states this really angers me and disappoints me a lot obama i know i wanted you to be president but you know you should not you don't need to change the flag because if we get our flag in rainbow colors it's I, I, I don't agree with it, and it, it, it just really angers me. I mean, really? You're going to change our first American flag that stood up while the bombs flew in the air during the war, and that our flag was still standing there. So you want to change our new, you want to change our American flag? when that flag was meant for a reason. It was history, and it's still history to this day. And I still live by the red, white, and blue, and the stars. So President Obama, if you change the American flag, it's your fault, it's your fault. And I know there's racism in this world, and it's not right to be racist, but who are we gonna stop? People are going to keep hating on every colored person. I mean, I mean, I know I heard about the Charleston shooting. I mean, that was very wrong with people getting shot in a church. Well, I hope that guy goes to jail if he is in jail. But, you know, it, it disappoints me. Like, you're just going to destroy our American flag and make a new one? We represent the red, white, and blue American flag and you want to change that that's not it's not how it goes it doesn't work like that but you know I'm sure all of you guys are watching this as I speak you guys can tell your comments below of what you think but my mom just got done telling me about this and you know it angers me because this is this is our country I mean yes we finally passed, you know, gay pride. I mean, I, I mean, I 50-50%, you know, support the gays, but then again, I don't because, you know, God says that men and women are supposed to be together. I mean, I'm not trying to be rude to all you same-sex people out there, but, I mean, like I said, we can't stop from the same sex loving the other same sex. I mean, it's it's going to be like that. But what else is going to change in the future? Like, what's next? Like, you like, like new laws or something? I mean, I don't know if Obama's trying to legalize marijuana, but I don't know about that. But he legalized gay marriage. But then again, changing the American flag is not okay with me. Not okay. Because, like I said, that flag stood up for each and every soldier in that war, and the bombs were flying, explosions were made, but our flag was still there. And as I say, oh say does that star-spangled banner yet wave, or the land of the free and the home of the brave, that flag was our American flag. So. I'm just going to pray that we don't get our flag changed because Martin Luther King tried to put an end to racism and, you know, it did create equal rights, but, you know, there's still people being racist. There's skinheads out there. Skinheads is a bunch of bald-headed guys who are against the blacks. And it's just, it's ridiculous. We can't stop racism, no matter how much we try. We can't stop it. If someone's talking crap about a black person, you just tell them, you know, hey, 
don't disrespect someone who's a different color from us. This world is not perfect. God did not create this world for violence. God created this world for peace and love and not to fight. And to me, I feel like we're just toiling on this earth because there's so much violence in this world. When we could, you know, go home to God and, you know, and I know, I mean, I know my mom says about the second coming of the Lord, and it means when God's going to take his children home, but some of you may be lucky to go home, but if you don't, you're just going to have to deal with Satan. Yeah. So, um, then again, like I said, this world was not meant for violence or racism. There's so much hate in this world. Maybe God has a reason to destroy it. I don't know. I mean, as far as I know, we're still living to this day. But, you know, it, God can do whatever he wants to this earth. He could say, right now, I could end it right now. But he's not, because he's not going to give up on us. Because he's not. Because we are God's children, and, I mean, if I was God, I'd be frustrated at the world and people, but that's the man upstairs, so. Anyway, guys, that's all I have to say. Like and subscribe, that kind of worries, and mom, and then, uh, there you have it. See you next time. Oh, quick question before I go. What do you think about Obama trying to change the American flag to the rainbow colors? Do you think it's right? Do you support it? Do you agree? Or do you disagree? Tell me below in the, com in the comments below. Like this video if you agree with me. Dislike it if you think that Obama is doing the wrong thing by changing the American flag. I mean, come on. Our soldiers worked for this. They fought for us. World War I. World War II. What's next? Who knows? Anyway, guys. I gotta go. Bye.